My child, your flesh is a debt long overdue. I have given you all this gift of life, and I shall so easily take it from you. Three days from now, I will return to raise the earth of all those who walk upon it. Only then will the debt be repaid. Three days. A young boy is suddenly haunted by apocalyptic nightmares. Although unsure of the sincerity of the message, it appears grave danger will befall the village in three days. Desperate to try and save the people of the village, the young boy attempts to try and stop a god. Which path will you take to attempt to prevent the end of the world? Waking up from a nightmare you can barely comprehend, you have three days to investigate the end of the world and work out how to save your village, if you can at all. Over 10 endings, choose your path through the twisted tale. Over 35 characters to interact with, each with their own goals from day to day. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Deadus, a brand new game by Spacebot. Now, we recently covered another game of theirs. There'll be a link to that in the video description if you want to check that one out. But this one today, unlike the last one where I got just the cartridge, this time I got the cartridge, I got the box, I got the booklet, and I got something really cool. I mean, this is awesome. A poster, but it's not just a poster. On the other side of it, is a map to what appears to be the entire game. I was going to stick the poster on the wall, but let's face it, it's too valuable. Especially for today's Let's Play. I'm blatantly going to need this fucking thing. So we're going to see if this game is any good. I mean, to be fair, the last game by Spacebot was really good. It was a great Zelda-like clone with sort of Pokemon Red bits pushed in there. Um, in terms of style, I mean, of course. It was a great game. It really was. This one looks a hell of a lot more awesome. I've been really psyched for this. Now, I won't lie, there's a good chance I've pronounced the game wrong. I'm calling it Deadus, but maybe it's Deadius or Dedus. I deduce that I do not fucking know. Anyway, we're playing it on the Nintendo GameCube, which is awesome console, but I've never been a fan of the controller, so watch me go the wrong way a lot of times because the D-pad is ass. That's enough bullshit. It's enough introduction, you've seen what it's like, you've heard the story, so you know as much as me. I've had this for a few days, getting ready to do this video. I haven't fucking played it. I promise you, I have no idea what's about to happen. So let's just go. Here we are. New game. My child, your flesh is a debt long overdue. We've already done this, haven't we? <laughs> I have given you all that this gift of life, you all this gift of life, I can word, and I shall so easily take it from you. Look at that guy. That's a bit freaky. Three days from now I will return to raise the earth of all those who walk upon it. Only then will the debt be repaid. The first day. I hope I'm not timed on this or we're fucked. So what do you reckon? Should we keep it in its natural green and red? Which is what you get when you play any original Game Boy game on a Game Boy Color. Should we keep it like that or should we make it all black and white? Let's have a quick look. Because of course this is on GameCube so we can fuck around with stuff. I just realise I'm talking out of my ass. That's when you're playing on the Super Nintendo, isn't it? I don't think you can change it on this, I can't remember. Fuck it! That looked really professional, didn't it? What a nightmare! Yes, that's our character's voice. Mature, young boy. I wonder if everyone is okay. I better go check on them. First, I'm going to read this book. Using this book, you can save your game. Aha! Do that, because I've gotten so far already. It's now safe to turn off your system. I don't want to. So, yeah, apparently there's ten endings to this game, which means there's obviously some shit ones. Gee, I wonder what kind of ending I'll get. 
that's if we go to a part two, because I likely won't get this done in one sitting. Are you okay? You sounded like you were having a bad dream. Monster? Coming to eat us? Well, shit, don't be silly. It was just a dream. The girl next door came knocking for you. I bet she did. She seemed troubled by something. Maybe you should check in on her. Well, sure, why not? Ugh. Also, don't be too late coming home tonight. When you are done exploring for the day, come back and get up to bed. Who knows what tomorrow will bring. So, do I start the next day whenever I return? If so, that's good. If we're timed, then my opinion on this game is going to drop significantly. Because no one likes that. I don't want your Majora's Mask bullshit, alright? Yes, heart. Wicked. Right. It's a little bit, um... Final Fantasy on the Game Boy, forward slash Oracle of Seasons. The tree there's remind me of that. Go in the door. Go in the door. Fucking D pad sucks. Are you the girl's dad? Hey there, buddy. She's up in her room. She seems upset by something, but she won't tell me. Can you see how she's doing for me? I'd really appreciate it. Sure, why not? If I can get through the door. GameCube controllers are poo! You came! I'm oh, sorry about that. I... I have a weird dream, and I wasn't sure who to talk to. I'm still trying to make sense of it. What? You had one too? Oh, fuck! I wonder if that means anything. Well, it probably does. I need to make sense of it all. You should see if any of the other kids had similar dreams. Maybe you should check in in the library. This reminds me of it, you know, like Pennywise the Clown, it, only the kids know about this freaky dream fucker. Which is a bit more Freddy Krueger when you put it that way, I guess. I'm sure they have books about nightmares. Why would they have books about nightmares? What's wrong with you cunts? Don't you read Spider-Man or anything? Or One Punch Man! How can more than one person share a dream like that? Please don't tell my dad about this. Sure, okay. Your daughter's a fucking crazy person. Hey there, buddy. She's up in her room. You've already read this. This was a waste of time. Yeah. Right. Left or right? Can we read the signs? Uh, home sweet home. Yurzen Falls, west of here. Okay, we don't... What's this one say? The local school is east of here. That way, then. School children. What's the sign say? Playing fields. Nobody's playing there, are they? Should I go check out that red thing? I don't know what it is. It's a flower. I'll take it with me. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know what I've achieved with that. I will say, excuse me, while I scratch. The good thing about playing a Game Boy with this whole green and red thing is any item or movable object, pick up an object, a little bit of object, appears in red. Whereas if you play it all in black and white, it's a bit of a lucky dip, isn't it? There's a cunt. Oh, hello. The teachers are here, if you would like, to talk to them about anything. I'm ignoring you. Uh. Huh? Weird nightmare. I mean, sure, who doesn't get nightmares? I didn't think too much of it. I didn't want to be late for school. Fucking NERD! Well, hello there. Feel free to take a seat. I don't want it. No! Aw, oh, fuck, I'm at school. <sighs> Welcome to religious studies! Oh. Many of you won't know this about me, but I went to a Catholic school, so I've had a lot of this shit. <sighs> Today we are going to learn a little bit about our local church. The church is free to visit, and I definitely recommend going for a look. It did say on the back of the box that the eye fucker was a god. So, uh. Can I go now? The main room is... Start again. The main room of the church is called a nerd. And in ours, that's where you can see the fabulous stained glass windows. Stained glass was a very popular way of displaying the messages of holy text to those who couldn't read back then. <laughs> we put up pretty pictures because you're all illiterate. That's probably true. Some say that the building itself was a series of tunnels and rooms that run beneath it. Has, I guess is what it said. 
Although I'm not sure if anyone has proven that. RING! Oh. That went by a lot quicker than I thought it would. I guess that's us for now. Feel free to swing by tomorrow for a little more, though. So the game's giving me the option and the information, basically, of saying, tomorrow, go where you've already been, because things will be different. That's blatantly what it's saying to me. So that's quite cool. Again, I just really hope that tomorrow's only kickstarted by me. Meaning I could go back now. I could technically go and end it. And then end the third day and we could get what would blatantly be the shittest ending. We could do that. Which is very tempting. <sighs> Hello there. Come in. Take a seat. I'm trying to do as many different voices as I can be fucked to do. Psst. We're learning about space rocks today. I can't wait. Okay, little miss. Fuck! First front, class can begin. Today we will discuss meteorites. A meteorite is a piece of rock metal that managed to make it through our atmosphere and crash land here on Earth. As they land, the flames of the atmosphere make them look like falling stars from space. Pretty cool, huh? I mean, it's alright, but you're looking at a spade there, mate. Because of the amazing view from the mountain top, so close to our village, many people have been able to spot them as they land and dig them up. I think I saw one on the mountain path. Can only do so many girl voices, of course. I couldn't get out of the ground, though. Well, I tell you what, if you come back to class tomorrow, I will bring you a trowel. Ooh! So if I come back tomorrow, I will get an item so I can get meteorites. Yay! Right, I'm learning. Ring! Well, that's it for today. Make sure you come by tomorrow. Okay. Fuck my old boots. Don't worry. Me? A nightmare? No. I didn't see anything. What a strange question to ask someone. Okay. So, I don't know if anyone would want a part two to this. Because I don't know how far we get. Oh, cunt. I didn't think it would be another class. Oh, there's no class in here today. Score! Please come back tomorrow. Oh, fuck. Alright, okay. We learnt some stuff. What's this way? The east leads to the road out of town. The south path leads to the church. Well, I think we're gonna go to the church. I have no idea where we should go, though. But there's something about flowers at the moment, isn't there? It's a flower. Guess what? It's a flower. Isn't that great? Okay, right. Ah, person. Hello, person. I hate this place. Okay. My best friend died, and they wouldn't let me bury them here. There's plenty of room. I had to lay him to rest close to here instead. It's not fair. Why do they have to treat him differently. He meant just as much to me as anyone else here. There's some weird stuff going on at this church, and they only care for themselves. Fuck him! Can I go in now? Thank you. Person? Person? Something isn't right about this church, and I'm going to get to the bottom of it, even if it kills me. Kid, I don't trust it. Keep an eye out for anything. You know, this building has more history than I think people realize. I love it more than I can tell you. Who knows what has happened here over the years. Right, well, father fuck. Hello there, my child, and welcome to the church. Sometimes this building is the perfect place to come and sit and make your peace with the world. I know that looking up at this stained glass Puts me at ease. Let's have a look at it. Hmm. I could sit and stare at it forever. There's something enveloping about it. Feel free to come by any time. No. What's that? A nightmare. It happens to us all, my child. An unfortunate aspect of life. It cannot be helped. 
He's weird. I don't like him. Fucking get out! Right. Okay. Church was useless. What's this way? This way. I hate the D-pad. Oh, look! It's, it's, it's a flower! These things serve a purpose. You know what we haven't done? See what Paul's does. Not a lot. Apparently you can have a lot. You can carry a lot. Uh, hello, I'm breaking into your house. Who the fuck are you? Hey, you, go right on up in his room. What? Uh, thank God you came. Sorry. <laughs> Happened again. Look, man, I'm freaking out right now, and you're my best friend. I. Right, what's your name? Who are you? Okay. I'm not sure who else to talk to. I had the scariest dream last night. This voice spoke directly to me and told me he was going to kill us all. What? You had the same dream? How is that even possible? It was so real, man. What are you doing? Is there anything we can't do? There's got to be some sort of... Clue. Sorry, the U looked a bit like a V on my crappy screen. Around the village. You gotta go see what you can find out. Someone has gotta know something. Just keep safe, man. Please let me know what you uncover. Well, you do what? Wank over porn? I'm gonna look at this porn. It's a porn. Issue 129. God spare the child with the porn. Huh? Bit weird. Oh, liberate! <gasps> it's a flower! I'm hoping if I get all of them, then I can become a florist. Not fucking far off of doing that, are we? Kate's now we're in a library. It's a list of all the books loaned out. Great. Hello there. Welcome to the library. Please feel free to look through our books. Bear in mind that we cycle our display books daily. Ah, so if we're going back, more or less ain't different. Okay. I don't want to rush to the next day, though. I don't think I should do that. I think I might make... This is a game consisting of three days. What do you reckon? We make this a three-part thing. One day for each part. Each Let's Play. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Either way, I'll only do one day today, and then we can go from there. I think that's a cool thing to do. We've got more time yet, so... Yeah, I'll carry on for now. I, I'm looking for books on nightmares. No reason. I, I'm looking for books on nightmares? No reason? Fucking cunt. Why won't you give me any answers? Shit. I thought maybe if I spoke to him again, do something. It is believed that people frequently distressed by nightmares could be re-experiencing some stressful event from the past. You mean when they went to the digital world? That could be it. The sleep of reason produces nightmares. What? Did I read that right? The sleep of reason produces nightmares. What? I've had nightmares before and there's really no reason to the shit going on in my fucking head. And in the room on the other side, I'm looking for a book on dealing with loss. My son, he just lost his first pet. He's pretty caught up about it, and I'm not sure what to do. If that was an accident, I couldn't even tell you what it was. Long ago in this village, there was a widespread hysteria about the second coming of a god. Ah, ha, ha, ha. The belief tore the village in half. Some believed... Vehemently? Oh, I've never encountered that word in my fucking life. I don't know what it means. So, fuck. Uh, great power was coming. There were various reports of murders across the village, but no evidence was ever found. It is not known if a great power arrived or not 15 years ago. The hell is vehem vehemently? Right. Apocalypses views and movements that focus on cryptic revelations about a sudden, dramatic, and cataclysmic intervention of a god in history. The judgment of all men, the salvation of the faithful, and the eventual rule 
of the new god. Huh? Something is scribbled here. Hail Dedus. Ooh. Okay. So Dedus is the name of the I God. Alright. So we oh wait, fuck. Did I go to the top one? I forget. Sorry. I'm just gonna check quickly. I have not been here. Thank god I was about to leave, wasn't I? Ooh, mysterious book. There's another book here. Wait, it's completely blank. I'll take it with me. We have an item that isn't a fucking flower, so that's a good. I was beginning to think it was all I could sod him well get. A weirdo in the corner. Where is it? Where is it? <sighs> ah. What do you want, kid? Can't you see I'm busy here? Yeah! Fine, fuck you, jerk. Douchebag. Wait, can I go down? Is down a thing? No. Okay, worth trying. Oh, it's fucking controller. Why did I not play this on the SNES? Because convenience. Right. We should go this way, read this. Path out of town. I don't know if we want to leave town. This road leads out of town. I better not leave. Give me a minute, I'm just gonna look at the map. Okay, so looking at the map now, this map is actually incredibly useful. It, it does appear to be the entire fucking game. So... There's a police station. If I go right from the library, past a house and straight down. Okay. Let's see if that's right. Past the library. Into the fence, into the fence. Right, down here. And then police station. That map. That map is the way to do this game. It really is. Oh my fuck, go through the cunting door. Please, my son has been missing for days now, and you have done nothing to help. I don't know where else to turn. Sir, I have told you that we don't care. Everything that we can. We have our officers out looking for him uh, right now. Maybe. I understand you are distressed, maybe, but if I care. I'm not sure what else to tell you, so fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Wow, angry. Right, let's talk to pissed off sad eyes. I don't know what to do. I miss my boy so much. He started hanging around with some real shady types. Started spouting some nonsense about being a watched. Wait, did I read that right? Was that being a watched or being watched? Sorry, I'll have a quick drink. Okay. Cult. He used to play around the mountains a lot. I just hope we can find him. I gotta go to the mountains. Hey kid! That way at least we're a jail cell. There's a real nasty piece of crap in there, currently. I would really advise against going in. I'll go in. He shouldn't have let me, that was bullshit. 37. 37. 37. Who are you? Which one of them sent you? I get out of here in two days, kid. And I'm gonna kill all of you. Yeah! All of you! Two days, kid. You best get out of here. Cause when I get out, ain't no man or God who'll stop me. Seems like a lot's happening in three days' time. Well, technically it's two, because this is the first of three. So, two days' time is going to be some bad shit. Yeah, uh huh. Right, let me. I'm going to quick keep referring to this map. It doesn't look like there's a hell of a lot down there. Um, I mean, there could be more bloody flowers, of course. But there's a weird mounting area. By the look of it, and there's a house up there. Or a hut. So, I'm going to go to there. Looks like if I go down one more, as right as far as I can, then up as far as I can. That's the plan. That's what we're going to do. Look, oh, there's a house here. I didn't even spot that because I'm a dick. Well, let's check it out. We should check out everywhere. Go the fucking door! It's a punk. Hey, little buddy. White long face. I love this little beach house. It's the 
perfect place to come and chill if you've had too much sun. If I ain't out surfing, you can usually find me here or on the sand. So if we need to find this gun for whatever magical reason, we now know where he will be. I, 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 I don't know. Oh, bloody flower again. I don't know what they do, so I'm just going to grab them all. Fucking thing. Right, two old people. I think they're old anyway. We are pretty much inseparable these days. I don't know what I'd do without him, to be honest. It's such a beautiful day. When you get to our age, you learn to appreciate the little things like walks by the ocean. See, I guess that they were old people with the little 8-bit crappiness that there is. Another fucking flower. God, it's like Nuzlocke Challenge with a fucking Pokenav. Okay. Mount it. Wait. Mount it. Gee, I think the mountain's here. At least the mountain top cafe. It's a cafe up there. Uh, hello. Who are you? I'm not hiding. Look, they kicked me out. Just take this and come find me tomorrow. Obtain Mr. E.K. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. Another bloody flower. I want to go everywhere I can before I fucking... Uh, you know, end the day. I don't know what ending we're gonna get. That's the really cool thing. There's ten endings you can get. Blatantly, there's one where you just epic fail by ending the days as quick as you can. That must be an ending. But there must also be a really good ending. And I would like to try for it. Probably won't get it, but we should still try. Oh, fuck me, it's Carrot Top. I don't know how he sounds, I only know the picture of the fuck. Hello there, and welcome to my mountain top coffee shop. Feel free to take a seat and enjoy the company. I'd rather just... no. Hello there, love. What's that? Bad dream? It seems that there's plenty of that going around. My little grandson was saying the same thing this morning. The thing about dreams is, they can never really hurt you. It'll be fine. You'll grow out of it before you know it. Take care, love. Right, sure. So this is the kid. I hate working here. It'll all be over soon, I guess. Uh, I have a day off tomorrow. That, that's what I meant. This guy blindly is in that cult. I cannot wait. I'm going to spend the day at the beach and work on this town. Maybe see you there? Sounds like the beach is definitely a place to go tomorrow. Hello there. Thank you for coming all the way up to see us. It's a beautiful day. You definitely shouldn't miss the chance to go up and check out the view. Get out of my fucking way. Get out of my fucking way, you stupid wolf. Right, that didn't achieve much, did it? That rock is movable. This rock is pretty well buried. Maybe if I had something to... Ah, oh, the trowel. Alright, tomorrow I have to come back here. This is a door, isn't it? There's a weird keyhole here. Oh, piss. Mysterious key doesn't fit here. What? Wait. There's a weird keyhole here. The mysterious key doesn't fit here. Oh, did that... I never checked what that cunt gave me. Was it a key? It was a key. I should have looked in there. Dickhead. And up here is obviously the windfish egg. Or a bench. Can I do that again? Maybe it's gone down a bit. That will plainly look different tomorrow. Oh, you know, I'm really excited to go to the next day. I'd happily do it right now, but it's like... There's a good chance that people would want a part two to see more. Because I don't think we should try and squish everything into one video. Um, can I go? No. Right, give me a second. 
I'm going to refer to the map. Right, there's a couple more places I'd like to go. I don't know if there'll be anything there, because they're not really buildings. There's the actual beach. We haven't been. There is an actual beach, by the look of it, so we're going to go there. Um, but it looks like we've nearly gone everywhere. Almost. I think we've gone to all of the main areas. Do you know what's really refreshing about this game for me? Is there's no fighting and no battles, no turn base, no anything. Normally you think, why would you want that? It's like, no, this game is all about the story. All about the story. You don't get that on Game Boy. That's why this is really cool. Eurizen Falls. Oh, I read about that somewhere. It is said that this waterfall comes straight from the sun above. Yeah. Can I anything? I can't anything. At least I can't anything. Yeah. It's where we live. I want to talk to, apparently that girl's girlfriend is listed as girlfriend on the map, so that's who she is, I guess. So we'll go to beach, which I think's over here, and then down a bit. That's another fucking flower. Again, I don't know what they do. I should probably read that in a booklet. Oh, you know what? I will in a minute. The beach. Well, I guessed right. There's nothing here. Shit. I should have read this sooner. I'm so used to not having a booklet these days. That's what it is. When I collect retro games, they usually don't have a booklet with them. And modern games, just straight up don't have a booklet with them. So, I just gotten out of the habit when I was a kid. Get a game, you read the fucking booklet before you turn the game on. I was always like that. Now, I figured it exists. Even though I showed it at the start of this video, so I'm a fucking idiot. Right, let's read this. In the world of Deadus, you control a young boy trying to track down the source of his nightmares and how to save his village. There are many possible endings to achieve in Deadus, depending on your path through the game. You go about this by progressing from screen to screen and checking in on the residents of the village. Some may give clues to the nightmare and possible solutions to help save the village. You can progress to the next day of the adventure by returning home and sleeping in the player's bed. Some events in the game develop from day to day, so be sure to check in on any friends you make along the way. So yeah, that's about it really. I mean, there's even a mini-map in here, but it's crap, it's not a lot to go by. Um, we've met a lot of the characters. All the characters are listed in this booklet as well, which is awesome. There's also a bit about the items at the back. Ah, flowers. A sweet-smelling flower. A perfect gift. Get enough of them, and they will blatantly be used somewhere. There's a ton of other items here, and there's one or two that are kind of spoilery, so I'm not, not going to say them. I don't want to spoil it. I wish I hadn't fucking seen it now. But never mind, I get an idea what the bloody flowers are for. Get the fuck out of that shit. So, now we head right. What's this say? Pier? Oh, more people. Hello, dearie. Don't mind me. Just taking a walk to clear my head. No reason. You had a nightmare, didn't you, you fuck? A lot of people have had nightmares. It's a flower. I'll take it with me. Mm. Running out of faces for that. Come on. <laughs> Nothing can be inside an edgeless universe. Toba better. Right. It's... Someone. Whoa. You snuck up on me, kid. Scared the life out of me. You go careful playing around on this pier. I don't want you falling in, you hear. Okay. I feel like I've nearly exhausted everything I can do for the first day. The funny thing is, you may get a better ending by not talking to certain people. Like, maybe if you don't go to the church. Oh, is this a grave? Here lies Smucky. Who the fuck is Smucky? He was obedient. It's a dog. Okay, there's only a couple more things I want to do, and then I feel like we're done. Oh, uh, right, there you are. That's it. I think that's about it. Yeah. Okay, we're going to go talk to the girlfriend one more time. Then I'm going to save. I won't go to the next day until the next video, if that's what people want. If you don't want it, it's fine. I'll play the game on my own. I will not lose out. And for you, that's entirely your choice if you give a shit. I hope you give a shit. Right. Okay. Arsehole! Right. <laughs> I hate it when I do that. 
Let me know if you find anything. Oh! Oh, do you have something for me? Yes! Yes, I do! Give flower. I was going to give her the book. Maybe she can figure something with that. Oh, flower? These are my favorite. Thank you so much. Ha. Oh, you have nine flowers. I'll get this in a pot right away. Can I give her another one? Oh, flower, these are my favorite. Thank you. You have eight flowers. Right, you know what? I don't know if there's anyone else I would give a shit about giving flowers to. Maybe your mum, but I don't care. What we're going to do is we're going to give them all a girlfriend. That's the route I'm going to take. So, since it's the same text, I'll just quickly skip this bit for you. You have zero flowers. There you go, we've finally done that shit. Um, I don't know if that does anything. Oh, you have given me enough flowers to fill all of my pots now. That is so nice of you. I couldn't possible take another... I couldn't possible... That's a fuck up. Never mind. Take off another one of you. In fact, I have so many now, I can give you this pretty one I was saving. You've obtained the special flower. You have one flower left. Well, shut up. It's just normal flower, isn't it? Oh, fuck me. They weren't there a minute ago. Can I give her that flower? I can't, but I've obviously done something. I wonder if this guy's like, you're a pervy git, give my daughter all that. No, right. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Get pissed off of this cunt. I still think I've been everywhere, and if I haven't, then cock it. I mean, I can't go up there, can I? Right, first of all, you know, I think that girl has a bit of a thing for you. But who are you? I'd take her some flowers when you check in on her. Thanks, Mum, you're absolutely fucking useless. Dappy bitch. Right. Now I feel if I go to the bed, the day will end. So we're just going to save. Game saved. Right. Ladies and gentlemen, that was Dedus. My first time playing it. Again, I don't know if it's called Dedus or Dedius or Dedus, whatever. But I'm really excited. This is really cool. Never have I played a Game Boy game that focuses so strongly on the story and gives you all these options in endings and things you can do. Not many clues on what path makes what happen, but that makes the mystery even cooler. I really like this. I hope you will want a part two. If you do, you just got to say it in the comments. That's all. If you want part two, Ask for part two, we'll make a part two. Because we'd only have to do a three part video. Video? A three part mini series? <laughs> I know that would mean like we try and get it out as quick as we could, but if you want that, let me know. We'll make it happen. Thank you very much for watching today's video. If you did enjoy it, please click like, leave the comment as we already suggested. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do so. Hopefully, the world will not end in three days' time. If it does. Um... Oh well, never mind. Bye!